My name is Danielle, and I go by Pasmo Thompson Pro. Welcome. Very truly of an awkward situation because I have pinkish red demi dye on my hair but over here is like a dark blue green so let's think I am going to be using Malibu products today I'm going to be using the Undugu the crystal gel CPR pack and the restorative moisture or something something I'm gonna bring the products and I'm gonna go show you one second I have the crystal gel I have the CPR pack and I have the miracle repair uh, I remember this stuff we used to um, make cocktails back in cosmetology school this was our stuff man and I have this Hydra 8 um, moisture conditioner too. I might just do the one that's in the pack, the Miracle Repair, and keep it pushing. Because I'm low-key trying to do this in one take. Because if I use the CPR, hopefully, 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 I don't have to use bleach. So, yeah. I'm going to take this out right now. And then we can get to going with the process and I'll explain each step. Let's go. Okay, so my hair is all taken out and I'm about to do the crystal gel. Um, it says two ounces of warm water. I have my warm water right here and mix it together, work it in the hair. Let's do that first step. Yeah, so I'm just applying the crystal gel. All right, and then I'm just going to apply a plastic cap. Yeah, and I'm going to let that sit. The package says from 10 to 15, 10 to 45 minutes. I'm going to let it sit for 20. Yeah. The next step is to do the CPR. Oh, um, I rinsed this out with warm water and then I used the undugu to rinse my hair out. With That's the shampoo that it told me to do on the back of it. Yeah. So this one, I need to put it in four ounces of water. I have my four ounces of water right here and I let it sit to get a room temperature because this requires room temperature and you have to be very precise. So... Um, yeah, CPR is first response to color correction. Color will not re-darken, yada, 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 yada. Okay, so, and it's not bleach. Okay, so fill in four ounces of water, room temperature. Add slowly, shape to dissolve, form gel, shampoo here. Okay, so it's just like that. Okay, so it's basically the same thing. All right, so I left the, um the crystal gel on for 20 minutes and for 15 of those minutes i applied heat i just used my blow dryer and like heat it up so this is going to be the same concept so yeah i'm just gonna come back while i'm putting it in i just measured the amount of water in my bowl and then i'm just about to throw in the powder Okay, that's cute. It looked just like a crystal gel. Alright. Let's get to going. I'm just going in and shampooing up my hair. Okay, they did say this would happen. They said people with sensitive scalp, they'll feel like tingling and stuff. So, that I do feel. That's fine though. 
not like a little itching, you know. For professional use only, due to low pH, tingling to sensitive scalp may appear on client's scalp and your hands. Okay, shampoo from the scalp if client is uncomfortable. Gloves may be used for application. Okay, so it is a bit annoying, but I'm just going to tough it out. Yeah. So I'm just applying that to my hair. I'm going to cover it and then I am going to go under the dryer for 20 minutes again. But I think I'm going to leave in the CPR for like 30. This is the perfect base for my um, dark green dye. I now just have to worry about this. So I was thinking about just toning it with some blue shampoo or conditioner or mask or whatever I have in there right now. And then um, putting the color on it. But it's just still too dark. It's still too orange. Um, I'm going to have to bleach it. So that is what I'm going to do now. It's passing like a peachy stage. Okay, so my hair is blow dried and stuff now, kind of. And it's actually lighter than I thought, the same color. So that's great. You can still see the dark hues from when I put on that um, black permanent color, but that's okay. I'm gonna do my skunk stripe first. Or should I do it after? Um, I think I'm gonna do it after <laughs> one thing i like about green is it low-key covers like <laughs> any shade like almost any shade it's one of those you can get away with it's crazy So now I'm taking the hunter green and I'm just gonna oh get into it get into it this is gonna be cute so now what I'm going to do is dry my head with my blow dryer um probably not until it's 100 percent dry but just to make sure most of that color is sealed in. But yeah, I love it. This reverse skunk stripe business is raw. Like, it looks so freaking good. My roots never catch color good. But this is cute. I'm not even gonna lie. So, it works. I'm going to use foam, style it, put on my do-rag, go to bed. 